the best cakes on Cake Boss. Hey guys, welcome back to another video here on Film Zone. Cake Boss has featured many impressive cakes during its run, and Carlos's bakery has enjoyed worldwide recognition and popularity thanks to this show. The Cake Boss boss Buddy Velastro has experienced his fair share of fame and controversy over the years, but through it all, he's kept baking at the now famous bakery. There have been some really amazing cakes coming out of the show, and we'll take a look at a few of the most amazing names. Stay tuned and watch the video right till the end. Before we start with the video, however, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. Turn on the bell for the latest notifications and updates. This way, you'll never miss another video. With that said, let's jump straight into today's video. Here are the best cakes from Cake Boss. Aquarium Cake when Buddy Velastro's niece asked for an under-the-sea themed cake for her Sweet 16, Velastro and his team set to work creating one of the most intricate and interactive desserts Carlos Bakeries has ever seen. And the center of the sprawling creation is a huge aquarium swimming with tropical fish and a handmade coral reef sculpture, and the edible underwater scene that surrounds it features cake-rendered sea creatures of all shapes and sizes. The team replicates the coral's jagged edges and varied textures with a combination of isomalt, modeling chocolate, fondant, and layered colorful frosting, all of which results in what they call the sickest coral we've ever done. And we have to agree. The team adorns the towering cake with flashing lights, making the whole scene appear watery and rippling. To top it off, Velastro engineers a helicopter-like propeller that spins two cake fish around the entire structure. With both real fish and the sweeter clones, this cake is a masterpiece that mimics the majestic world under the sea. As Velastro said, best cake ever. Sesame Street Cake Here, Buddy Velastro and his team are hired to make dessert to celebrate the 40th anniversary of Sesame Street. Carlos Bakery creates an entire city block out of cake. The final product captures each tiny detail of this beloved childhood show from the cobbled sidewalks to the piles of garbage Oscar the Grouch calls home. Velastro wanted the cake to properly commemorate Sesame Street's emphasis on interactive learning, so the cake portrays not only the characters of the show, but the letters and numbers they teach viewers as well. At approximately 8 feet long, the team had to transport the cake in separate pieces and then put it all together. That thing would never fit through the elevator, Velastro said. It all paid off in the end when Cake Boss viewers witnessed the whole cast of Sesame Street gathering around the table to take in the delicious miniature versions of themselves. I'm trying to contain myself, said Cookie Monster. Transformer Cake Buddy Velastro had to call in the troops for this one. The 7,000-pound Bumblebee model was made with an 8-10-person team and took the Cake Boss crew three days to complete. This was the hardest cake I've ever done, Velastro claimed, but it was also his proudest accomplishment. Though the cake doesn't work quite as well as the real Bumblebee, Velastro got the chance to try out the next best thing, for research purposes of course. Driving a new Camaro really inspired me to go out of my way and make an awesome cake, he said after his test drive. The finished cake featured multiple moving parts and pyrotechnics. Velastro even hired a hydraulic specialist for his project to ensure the cake was safe. NASA Cake for the 30th anniversary of NASA's space shuttle program, Buddy Velastro and his team made one of their most extravagant cakes of all time. The cake is impressive in itself. It contains each part of a functional spaceship, an orbiter attached to the solid rocket boosters, and an external tank frosted and seemingly ready for takeoff. But this cake is more than just frosting and fondant. As usual, Velastro couldn't resist going above and beyond, pun intended, expectations. This one flies. The team equipped the cake with pyrotechnics and mounted it to a moving scissor lift to give it the illusion of blasting off. With its flaming engine and the American flag hand-painted on the side of the rocket, it's easy to forget this machine is edible. Thankfully, it never actually shot into space. Velastro's clever engineering allowed guests to see rockets fly without losing their dessert to the stratosphere. Candy Mountain Cake This Candyland Wonderland Dream Cake was created for Buddy Velastro's son's first birthday, so of course it had to be special. The first birthday celebration is a pretty huge deal in Italian families, and Cake Boss honored the day by constructing a huge candy mountain for Carlo. The gigantic sculpture was put together by installing plywood sheets haphazardly on top of one another and later covered with cake, Rice Krispie treats, and fondant, all of which created the illusion of a natural landmark. Towering above Velastro, the cake is probably large enough to house his young kid and maintain a months-long sugar high. 
To add to this cake's nature scene, the team made candy trees and sugary woodland creatures to hide in the mountain's frosted crevices. Ever the maximalist, Velastro added a chocolate river to pull the piece together. By installing a pump inside the hollow structure, Velastro kept the syrupy current flowing all throughout the party, making several sticky-handed kids very happy. Leaning Tower of Pizza Cake Buddy Velastro isn't all pyrotechnics and pizzazz. His technical craft and artistry is what makes his cake so unique. There's no better cake to show off Velastro's fine-tuned detail work than the Leaning Tower of Pizza model he made for a wedding. The cake mimicked the Italian tower's medieval architecture down to each Corinthian column and capital. The couple who hired Carlo's Bakery stressed the importance of avoiding a falling over Tower of Pisa, but with the cake boss himself and the team of skilled bakers, their worries were for naught. At over four feet tall, it wasn't quite as big as the real thing, but it certainly tasted much better. Those were six of the best cakes on Cake Boss. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.